San Jose's police chief is defending his department after an officer shot a man. That story and more news coming up. Hi everyone, I'm Diana San Juan filling in for Abby who is off today. Let's get you synced in. This is surveillance video of a fight inside La Victoria Taqueria near San Jose State early Sunday morning. Kayon Green was inside when his attorney says he tried to disarm a gunman. The chief says his officers didn't know what Green's role was when they saw him with a gun. A team of officers approached the restaurant on foot as the fight was continuing. The fight moved out of the front door and onto the landing where one individual was holding the handgun. Officers gave repeated commands to drop the gun. However, the individual does not drop the gun and one officer shot more than one time striking the individual. The police yelled, drop the gun. And without giving my client a second to understand it was the police or to turn around and see what was going on or even to drop the gun, he was shot multiple times. Green is recovering in the hospital. His attorney says he's preparing legal action. Connecting BART to the South Bay, President Biden hopes to send another $200 million in federal funds to complete the Silicon Valley BART extension. The money comes from the president's most recent budget proposal. This would extend BART from the North San Jose Barriessa station through downtown San Jose to Santa Clara. That would be four more stations. Now you have to see this, a Marin County home is gone after the earth underneath it gave it way. It happened in Fairfax on Tuesday. The home crumbled into a pile of debris when the edge of the road next to it failed. Investigators say the recent rain didn't help, but most likely nearby excavation is to blame. The home was under construction, so no one was living in it and no one was hurt. All right guys, that's all for me today. Thanks for watching.